morning everybody who's ready for a kick-ass day I'm actually vlogging in the morning I'm about to make my coffee I slept in again my sleep has just been a thing I think I'm lacking salt um, basically when you're on keto you need to eat, you need to eat more salt than most people and I'm pretty sure I'm sweating way more than you know normal because it's hot so uh, I think I'm sweating out my salt and it's giving me cramps and low energy. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna hopefully buy some salt today, I think. I don't know. I gotta go to the gym. Um, and yeah, I don't know, I gotta, I gotta uh, charge you. <laughs> I'm just really tired, I need my coffee. <sighs> Okay, you guys, hair is up. I've had my breakfast. I'm going to, oof, it's hot in here. I was using the AC out there. Um, I'm going to get dressed in my gym gear and I'm gonna go to the gym. I didn't need to say that that way, but I did because fuck you. No, don't actually fuck you. Um, I can't remember what I was gonna say. Eh. Ooh, ow. Ooh, ow. Ooh, ow. Ooh, mm. ow. <laughs> I got that on footage. Eh, I'm gonna sneeze. Hang on. Ah, oh, bless me. Um, yeah, we're gonna go to the gym, whether you like it or not. Holy fuck, it is so hot outside. I just had an incredible back and shoulder session. I tried an exercise that my um, PT has recommended on his Instagram, which I will leave linked for you guys to check out. But um, yeah, holy shit, my shoulders. <laughs> If you guys want to see my uh, back and shoulders session, Beginner's Guide to the Gym is a playlist that you can find on my main channel. I used to have all my fitness stuff on here, but I don't know. I'm putting it on the other channel now because it's kind of like a New Year's resolution that people have and I figured let's get more people doing exercise properly. Anyway, I'm puffed. Let's go home. I'm 100% certain you guys can hear that music. But when I was in the thick of it, I was like thinking of like going in there and like acting all spaz, but I was like, no, that's really mean. Not only to the performance, but to everyone watching the performance. But just this like, I don't know, I ended up giggling, so I was thinking of me just going out there and acting like a complete moron, like seizing out in like an almost dancing kind of way. It's the little things that amuse me. for a guest day you can't see me I'm John Cena I am gonna get dressed and go and get my blood test done my fasted full blood count blood test then I gotta come home and edit a million and one videos and then I gotta film a million and one videos and then edit those million and one videos and then upload those videos and then maybe stream I don't know my morning routine has been all fucked up because I was supposed to be going to a meeting at 8 a.m. apparently. I thought it was 9 a.m. but it was 8 a.m. But it was cancelled so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> yeah, so also I look fucking bright red right now. I apologize. I mean I don't need to apologize for that. That's not something that I can really control I guess. Anyways, I'm just rambling because I haven't had anything and this noise is kind of starting to get on my nose but there's an amazing breeze that is coming in and I fucking live for it. We're starting to slowly but surely feel the summer fade away. Kind of. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. <gasps> so heavy. Oh god. But that silence though. Oof. Um, I think I might put my crystals out there so they can charge up. But I feel like they get sun here too. Turn off my bug sprayer. Got one of these little mortine things. Because when it is nice and cool at night and in the mornings, I do like to have my windows open and um, sleep with fresh air, oops. Oh God, I need some water. And then I'm going to get dressed and go get my blood test done. I'm so tired. Oh my God, you guys. <sighs> I think I'm mostly tired because of closing those doors. <laughs> That's depressing. Skinny. Oh my god, you guys. So, okay, first of all, I didn't actually bring my camera with me to the pathologist, even though I promised myself I would. And now that I have gone and not brought you, I don't think you really missed out on much, except that 
I had this incredible day planned out, right? I was gonna get my blood tested, then, because it was a fasting blood test, which I was like, cool, that'll be a good opportunity to walk into the city and get my fasting weight and blood pressure and all that shit done. And then I was like, I'll come home, I'll get ready, I'll go to the gym, then I'll go to the psychologist, but then after my blood test, well, actually I squirted, but <laughs> not what it sounds like. I've, I'm fucking weird without food, man. But like after the pathologist took the bloods, um, cause I mean, when you're fasting, your blood pressure is really low cause food and exercise are what raise your blood pressure along with a whole bunch of other things, but I'm not going to get into that. But, um, basically what happened was she was working so hard to get a, a vein to pop out. And then when she <laughs> pulled out the needle, I like squirted blood on her and she goes, Oh, you're bleeding. I need you to apply really, really firm pressure. Like, cause it wasn't just like a bleed. It was like a, um, so she's like, just be sure that you don't lift anything today and take it easy. And I'm like, that's right. Blood tests and exercise don't go hand in hand. So right now I'm going to take my medication and have a coffee, also something that raises your blood pressure, which can I just say, this is something, I think I am defying the laws of medicine and nature because generally when you've got a high resting heart rate, which I don't know if it is a high resting heart rate, but I know that my heart rate when I get it checked is at 90 beats per minute, which isn't extremely high, but it's 30 beats above what they would suggest for a healthy heart. But my blood pressure is 92 over 60, roughly 60 to 60, like 60 to 70. So my blood pressure is low and my heart rate is high. Whereas if you've got like a high heart rate, generally your blood pressure is higher as well. So, or is it the other way around? No, actually it does make sense. If your blood pressure is really low, your heart has to... I don't know. I'm really tired. My brain's not working. The camera is way heavier than it should be because I haven't eaten anything. Um, and my legs feel fine after yesterday's leg session. I didn't vlog yesterday or the day before that or the day before that. I think I did. Um, but my legs feel fine after my leg session, even though I came home early because it wasn't that I was failing. It was that my body was just like tapping out. I hadn't eaten anything. So we're learning things about me today. I'm gonna fucking start with my day. I'm so tired. <sighs> also just found out that I accidentally in my fucking food deprived state told her milligrams because I honestly thought it was MG for my thyroxine. It's micrograms. So I don't take milligrams. Oh, that's such a massive difference. The difference between 100 micrograms and 100 milligrams is Tremendous. <laughs> oh, I feel so silly. Fuck, that's funny. Ugh. I need coffee, obviously. <laughs> oh, hey, vlog. I didn't vlog yesterday. I can't remember where I was with the last vlog footage that you guys saw. I literally have no idea what's going on right now. I'm, uh, um, I mean, like, I you know what's going on. Sorry, I need to put you somewhere so that you can see what's going on. Because I'm a has some macadamias, girl. Um, I'm honestly so tired. I've been walking up and back to mum's place for, like, past God knows how long. Because, um, like, where was I going with this? Oh, yeah, I'm doing my laundry at mum's place. Because I still don't have a washing machine. So, I got two more loads in there, technically. Gonna do that. Got the gym today. Got videos I need to do. And honestly, I just wanna sleep. I'm so tired. But, what can you do? Uh, so I've done like 5,000 steps. And honestly, I just wanna nap. But my bedding is not quite done. So what's happened is I've done my sheet but the fitted sheet is only just in the dryer now. So I'm just gonna, you know, pull out all my other laundry and fuck it. The thing, okay, so I hate taking the stuffing out of sports bras, but then if you don't, it just curls up inside in the wash or in the dry or whatever. So I'm gonna take that out and then restuff it. 
I don't know why I don't just take it out in the first place and then stuff it. I'm so tired. <laughs> I have decided no naps. I'm going to have lunch because I'm hungry. So I, okay, I was talking to Joseph about this. Joseph uh, Scrivens came, hung out, uh, and we were talking about how, uh, damn it. Uh, I guess I can take two out. Yeah, that shouldn't be too bad. Um, we we're talking about how, okay, so hang on, this is 500 grams and there's four in there. That makes like 125 grams each. Sorry, I'm gonna have some pork belly for lunch. Probably gonna use garlic salt because I don't have soy sauce. Anyway, um, we were talking about how like I love my fridge because I can just put my um, camera on top of it and vlog. Oh, this dank. And not in the nice way. Sorry, I like made myself a black coffee this morning and then didn't pour it out because I didn't drink it. We went and got real coffee. Um, but yeah, I think I need food and caffeine and a whole bunch of other things. Just like my brain is like not computing. Oh my God, you guys. Okay, so I'm, I'm thinking maybe I'm even just in keto flu. Cause like there was a couple of days there, hang on, let me put my camera down. Uh, that's not safe at all. Um, there were a few days there, you can't see anything. Sorry, there were a few days there where I um, had sugar, but I didn't think I would need to go through keto flu again. I don't know, there's just a few things that it could be and I can't seem to figure it out, but I'm just waiting it out. The brain fog is kind of really annoying, but I'm going to the gym now, and by that I mean I'm going to my PT session, which is actually in a hospital, um, cause, you know. Um, I don't know, I'm really fucking tired, man. Uh, fuck. Okay, so, I don't know the last thing that I vlogged, cause my brain, my brain is better off to having all that caffeine and that workout, but before that caffeine and before that workout, I forgot my vlogging camera and my wallet. So while I was supposed to go and get cream, and, okay, maybe the brain fog isn't that much better. Um, I think it was just cream, maybe some other shit. I don't know, we'll find out, but I've got to get that. And I didn't have my wallet and I didn't have my vlogging camera. So now I came home, I've done 12,000 steps. It's time for me to head back out to the Woolworths, which is a few more steps than the Coles. And then, when I come back, it is edit central, honey. Kind of, is that a pimple? Probably. Yeah, oh well. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna end the vlog here because I'm gonna be doing a shitload of editing and other shit, but I'm like 98% sure that this vlog is gonna be stupidly long because I'm combining like three days from what I can tell. So I hope you guys are having an amazing day or morning or evening, whatever time date is for you. And you guys will see me tomorrow, which I have no idea what the hell I'm doing tomorrow. Probably going to the gym, <laughs> knowing me, live streaming, doing all that stuff. Uh, lots of video editing happening. So, um, also, I'm going to close out the vlog with this. I'm not bummed out. I'm not annoyed. I'm not... I really, I really couldn't care less. Like, the amount of... The amount of revenue that I really get off YouTube is <laughs> next to nothing. Like, it's maybe six to seven dollars a month. So, it's not that much. It's the label of partnership that I was kind of really, I guess, boastful for. So if you guys do want to help me out, uh, it would mean a massive favor. It would mean the world to me. It would be a massive favor if you could uh, go ahead and watch some videos. I mean, even if you put one of my playlists on in the background, just to listen to, you know, you don't really have to watch. I, I really don't care either way, but it'd be nice if you guys could uh, help out with that. But I mean, like I said, you don't have to, so. I really don't care either way. I know that if I'm gonna be partner, I'm gonna be partner. Like, I'm not letting my mood or ego or <laughs> anything be upset by the fact that YouTube is putting in stricter requirements for partnership. Because if anything, it just makes me feel even more accomplished when I get it again, so. Because, I mean, you could get partnership so easy before. Um, and then they made it a little bit more difficult, and I still maintained that. But now it is 
significantly more difficult because it's 4,000 hours watched in a year. And I thought that Harry Frankfurt had accomplished that because I have so many videos, but I've only got 2,000 hours in the last 365 days, which I, yeah, the more I think about it, I'm like, fuck, um, which is fine. Cause I'm, I'm not deterred in any way. It doesn't phase me. It was $7 a month. Like, I don't think I'm really allowed to say that, but you can figure it out. If the average cost per thousand is one to $2, you can go on social blade and check out how many thousands of, Oh, pretty. How many thousands of views I was getting. It's, it's insignificant. It doesn't bother me. And I'm not phased, I'm not deterred, I'm still gonna be uploading videos. If anything, I'm more motivated to upload more videos and get those um, hours up. So, yes. Um, uh, yeah, anyway, the, the whole point of that was, thank you guys if you got to this point because it is helping me tremendously. And um, thank you to anyone who watches all of my videos. It helps tremendously. And you guys will see me tomorrow. So I hope you're having an amazing day or morning or evening, whatever time date is for you. And I apologize for this one being so long, but I thank you if you got this far. If you did, leave a comment saying air conditioning. <laughs> Good night, guys.